Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be talking to you about my updated skincare routine and some tips that may help you if you suffer with acne and oily skin. My skin isn't perfect but I feel like I am improving in my skin so I'm going to share with you what I've done to achieve this. My first tip would be to take your makeup off. Not just with a face wipe, use a spin brush to effectively remove all of your makeup out of your pores. This could be causing your acne if you leave it on for too long. I don't wear makeup, but I know this step is really, really important if you do wear it. Invest in a good face wash, but nothing that is proved to dry out your face. This will make it become even more oily. Use something that will actually clean your face without drying it out. The Mario Badescu Acne Facial Cleanser is a daily cleanser for oily, acne-prone skin types. It's gentle and effective which is made to use morning and evening. It's formulated with a blend of natural extracts. It removes makeup, dirt and impurities without stripping of essential oils and moisture. It also includes salicylic acid which is essential for soothing and reducing blemishes. Use a mud mask, especially if you have acne and oily skin. Start off by doing this once a week but once your skin gets used to it, three times a week will really get into your pores and clear all the dirt from your face that causes it to be oily and have acne. The Aztec Secret Indian Healing Clay is my favourite mask of all time. It helps get deep into your pores and really get out all of the toxins in your skin. I've been using this for two years now and my skin is always clearer when I use it. I mix this with apple cider vinegar which contains alpha hydroxy acids that will remove your dead skin cells and reveal healthy and vibrant new skin. It fades scars and helps acne and tightens pores. And then, after leaving this mask to suck in your face for 20 minutes, you will look like you've just had Botox, or like a frog, or like a frog who's just had Botox. You choose. And then, after vigorously washing off your face for 20 minutes, because this mask is so hard to get off, you will look like you've just had a vampire facial. Once you've let your skin calm down, use a toner. Using toner can make or break your skincare routine. You don't need to spend loads and loads of money on a high-end one either. Which hazelnut only fights acne, it decreases redness and oil and improves your overall skin complexion. It also fades scars and you can reapply this any time of the day because of its soothing effect and 100% natural properties. I also mix this with apple cider vinegar. For people with oily skin, we often think that moisturising your skin will cause your skin to be even more oily. In fact, oily skin is a form of dry skin because your glands in your pores think that your skin is super dry so it continues to produce oil all of the time. One of the ways to help this is to make sure you moisturise twice a day. For night time, I use my Aero Organics moisturiser. It includes amino acids, vitamin E and so many other beneficial natural ingredients to help your skin. If you want a spot treatment, I definitely recommend tea tree oil. Tea tree oil is very effective for targeting individual spots, but be careful not to overuse it. Even though it's gentler than benzoyl peroxide, which is a standard spot treatment used by doctors, Tea tree oil can be very drying as it causes your skin to overproduce oils and makes your acne even worse. But using it on your spots with a cotton swab every night before bed is 100% fine. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Just a little disclaimer, obviously everything that I've used in this video may not work for you and also you have to incorporate other things to make your skin clear, like your lifestyle. Everyone doesn't like hearing this but I wouldn't have these kind of results if it wasn't the fact that I drank water, that I avoided certain foods and stuff like that. But these skin stuff do work and I do recommend everything that I used, but you need to think about your actual diet and how that will affect your skin and your oil and everything to do with your face. So that's just the disclaimer out of the way. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment down below things you want to see in next videos. Oh, all the way, cause when I'm with you it's the holidays. No other place I'd rather be, I'm right here with my family. And it feels so good to be free, you're all I really want.